Laurie, congratulations. I don't think we ever envisaged that promotion would come like this, but what an emotional night. It's, it's been unbelievable. And, you know, we've all been uh, sat here as a team, as a, as a management group, watching the game. And uh, I, I, I'll be honest with you, I thought with a minute, 30 seconds to go, I thought we were going to be having to sort of, uh, you know, take care of business ourselves. And what an unbelievable emotional sort of end to, to, to the game. And you can see, well, you've seen the footage now on social media in terms of how everyone celebrated and, and what it means to everyone within this group, the players, the, the management team, the coaching staff. It's, it's just an unbelievable evening. And, and, it's, and it's the culmination of an enormous amount of hard work that's gone in um, last year, but particularly this year in terms of sort of building this group of players and, and building this club up to, to where we are now. And, 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 and everyone thoroughly, thoroughly deserves where we are tonight and, and, and they should really enjoy it. Yeah, I mean, the players obviously deserve enormous credit for what they've achieved, but I know you will take the overall view of what the club has achieved itself as an entire entity. Yeah, I, I think that's the, the point, Mikey. I think uh, the players have worked incredibly hard. Um, they're the ones that graft on the pitch, and, you know, we've had some, as you, well, you, I've listened to your commentary sort of after all the games I've been at, and so you know exactly the enormous effort that's gone in. But, I mean, this has been a club effort from players from coaches staff to management to club staff and the fans I can't even speak highly enough about the contribution from the fans this year and everyone as a community as a city we have pulled together and been one club one city and and and, and this feeling that everyone should be feeling tonight is really sort of the, the galvanization of that of that um, that process of building everything together and yeah we're, we're one club one city and it's and, you know we should rightly feel quite unified and united tonight. I was going to say, do managing directors get emotional? You sound like you're getting a bit emotional. <laughs> yeah, I am. I am. I, I, I was shaking like a leaf at, like when when uh, when Brentford scored in there, just because you know it, we we share the emotion the same as the fans do every single week, week in week out. You know, and whenever we've lost, which you know, thankfully this year has been you know really rare, but you know we share the same sort of depression on a Monday, and the office is a is a is a flatter place and. But equally, we get the highs as well, and it's, it's you know it's, it's been incredibly emotional tonight. And that's as I said a minute ago, that's that result there now has just been you know is the end of a, a long, long, hard piece of work for us this year. And but you know putting it a little bit into context, you know promotion is that's just one step in this journey. We see this club now going on, and and and, and we've got a huge amount of development that we want to do. So this is the bit that we should be extremely happy about now, and, um, and rightly so, but this is just the beginning in terms of where this club's going to go. We are going to continue to kick on, and, and we're going to be in the Premier League next year, and um, we're not going to be there to make up the numbers. We're going to compete hard, and that's, that's the plan.